Welcome to another K Tip from Cac Varley here. Um, first, I wanted to say thank you for all the comments about my albums on my wall here. Uh, I do appreciate you taking notice to those. Uh, somebody gave me the idea of, hey, why don't you have bands give you give you uh, uh, some vinyl so that it could be advertised during your K Tips? I thought that was a great idea. If there's any bands out there that would like for me to display their vinyl on my wall, I'm happy to do it. Okay, today I wanted to talk about financial advisors. I have a financial advisor and I thought about some things that he could do to extend himself into the digital world. One thing I noticed from him is that I barely ever talked to him. And that's because he told me it was hard to get people to come out because of their schedules, which makes sense. But then I said, well, why don't you do video conferencing on a regular basis to stay in front of Because he's losing clients right now because of the market fluctuations and the pandemic. So I said, you're going to want to stay in touch with those. Retention is going to be a huge part of your business right now. And he agreed. I said, why don't you do video conferencing? There's plenty of tools out there that can help you do that and do it on a regular basis. He said, that was great. And he started doing it right away, which was fantastic. Now, another thing that I thought was interesting is that he did uh, schedule a video conference with me and he said, let's do it at such and such time. I said, great. Next week came along and I, all of a sudden I got this email saying, join me now. And so I noticed it was from my financial advisor. So I got online right away thinking, oh, it must be, it must be an emergency. When I got on the call, it became quite clear to me that I had forgot that there was a meeting because I didn't put it in my calendar. And I said to him, I said, hey, how come you don't use like a, a, an appointment schedule or why didn't you just, just at least send an invite so it was in my calendar? And he goes, well, if you don't know how to figure out your calendar, well, I said, and I was like, first off, that's poor customer service. But number two, if you want to keep and retain your clients, you got to help them out and stay in a situation so they're not canceling or missing appointments because that's valuable time to a financial advisor. So I recommended to him that he use an appointment schedule. Again, there's a bunch of tools that you can use to do that where it sends an invite out. Well, first of all, there's tools out there where that can literally sync to your calendar you can send it out to a client as a link. They can see when you're available available in the calendar. By the way, you can actually embed this into your website if, if you wish. So that clients can go right to your website and, and book a meeting. But otherwise, you send a link to them. They see that you're available at such a time. They click the time they want, put in their email address, and it sends them an invite and puts it in their calendar automatically so that they don't miss the meeting. So that's how financial advisors, just on a couple ideas, can extend themselves into the digital world. If you need any help on figuring out what those tools are, please reach out to me at cagfarley.com. That's K-A-K-V as in Victor, A-R-L-E-Y.com. And this K-Tip was sponsored by 411, a social media calendar that does the thinking for you. If you're tired, of posting online, trying to figure out how to in engage your audience or be more effective, 411 is the tool for you. Their website is F-O-U-R, numeral one, O-N-E.com. Thanks a bunch, folks. Have a great day, and I will be back.